I'm Barry Salado Suarez, man. Uh, aspirant under the uh, banner of uh, All Progressive Congress Party for the legal status of assembly by election. We just have to say. Yes, a very common passion to have and uh, my passion is born out of uh, extreme delivery of uh, interest in the, in the people in the big people of the Delta from day one and I believe strongly uh, my coming out is born out of the emergency need in order to to show up the the uh, the lacuna being left behind by late favorable Kazim Adimola, uh, popularly called Kadeko, who just passed on uh, in, in recently. And uh, we believe that have uh, really come, uh, you know, really brought me to taking the the, 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 the task and continue where it stopped, in giving the people of Itosa the, the, the adequate representation, legislative uh, delivery and also ensuring to consolidate on the good achievement of His Excellency that is the uh, Governor Akim Nambodi of Lagos State and in ensuring that the, 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 the voices of each other is well heard within the uh, within the Lagos State as well. Set. All Progressive Congress as a party uh, has always been a party that has come with a whole lot of uh, um, deliverables, especially in the center of excellence. And I believe it's a party that has been matched with excellence, a party that has the, the interest of the people at heart. It's a party that has created that value in, with intent of purpose, they believe me. And uh, there's no way, no how, that one might want to undermine or overemphasize the, 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 the laudable and, mark, and, and, and the landmark achievement of the APC in Lagos, which is a party that started with AD metamorphosis to ACN, from AC to ACN, and now to APC based on the amalgamation of all other political parties in order to, to achieve the federal part at the national level. But that notwithstanding, the, 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 the insurmountable achievement of the party in Lagos State has been, has, has been a story that has been able to carve a niche for itself. And the niche is really predicated on positive pedestal of hope. It's, it's a ground norm which the people have taken as a culture. APC in Lagos State is not just a party, but a movement, a, an, a, a, an enclave interest of the people because Lagosians are already part of the party. Lagosians have already you know, had, had very good experience of the party. Yeah, let's go forward and no going back. Anybody know what make me day on track? We're coming in as a frontier and the flag bearer of the party is a well-deserving advantage to add value to the party. I believe strongly, if given the chances to lead and to act as the, as, as the vanguard boss of the people of the social constituents we want, under the banner of all progressive congress, a party that represents democracy, a party that represents a uh, 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 delivery of law, a party that, res that respects the, the, the rights and privileges of the people is a, is, a, is a party for all and is a party that represents the supremacy of the people's interests. And I believe strongly I'm part of that political uh, home. I'm very lovable to, 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 um, to belong to the family of APC. And I believe strongly with the party I can deliver and consolidate on the, on, on the grand achievement which the party that I've been well known for before my coming in as a member of the Gospel Council. Oh, well, as a member of the Lagos of, 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 of Assembly, if elected into the House of Assembly, I, Olado Tumazan, will be readily interested to bring forth to the, to, 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 uh, to the floor of the House well valuable legislative rules and, 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 and views that will affect not just the people of Ijosa but the entire constituent of Lagos State. But I, as a person, one of my very focal interests is to ensure that we'll, we will be seeing the House as a partner in progress to, to show up and consolidate on the achievements of Governor Akio Miyambo in the areas of the community development rights. 
that is one of my major focus. I, Olado Tuazan, with my with my valued interest and, and compassionate opinion on the service to humanity, I want to ensure that it is it will be high time the people of Lagos State, especially my constituency, will be given the the the, the, the high potent value of representation where their right to their community well. These are vis-a-vis -vis related to what we have as the 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 the, the, the resource control that is in in, in some terms, in some spheres. I want to believe if we domesticate it under what we call community development rights act, this will give my people the right to access to to good roads, to quality uh, 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 employment opportunities, to a lot of goodwill advantage because in that law, I want to ensure that 10% of accredited benefits of those companies vis-a-vis -vis employable rights, vis-a-vis -vis deliveries and, and, and opportunities for growth of the community will be imbibed into that law, whereby the, the people of, 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 of the same community can have access to companies that we have around the, the the constituency, we have companies like Chevron, NMPC, all of them have well, well situated within the constituency. But I can verifiably tell you today, none of these companies has employed the downtrodden within the communities of Etiosa. These are values I want to go and ensure that it will become a right and not a privilege. That these companies must be able to, 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 to employ at least 10 percent of their workforce must come from the immediate community they are, that they are generating their revenue from these are one of the basic rights which if i find it passed as a law and assented by the governor of lagos state it will give value to every Lagosian in lagos state because every domicile structure within the state has a potential opportunity that can galvanize interests of people to a, to a greater height and these are very common value that I want to ensure that if given the opportunity, that bill called Lagos State Community Rights Act will ensure that every adequate interest, vis a vis goodwill, uh, 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 educational support program, CSR of those organizations, everything will be, will be inculcated. And I want to still appeal to the Lagos State government to have a common ground whereby we can appeal to the state to give tax holidays to all these companies in order to accommodate these as part of their responsibility. Because if, if those corporate multinationals take some responsibility, it will really relieve the government overburden commitment to believe in and to ensuring that the people's interests are brought on the same common table because these are wealth uh, of interest that is getting my thought to ensuring that if this bill succeeds and also we'll be having what we call the Lagos State Transport Fair Management Authority. These are one of the key things that is killing Lagosia. It's karaokeated amount that is placed on transport fares in Lagos State abysmally by conductors and bus drivers has really weakened the, the, the pocket of Lagosians. But I believe strongly that if we have a law that has price control mechanism in all our parts, that from Obanin Day to Semes there will be a well straightforward amount that you are supposed to pay from CMS to Ikurudu, you know how much your budget will be. These are variables that I believe it might look so unsound and uncommon, but I want it to, I, I want Lagosians to hold it, that if you have this opportunity, it will also relieve. Also, we want to ensure that our legislative system will be more accessible to the people. I want to put before the House to ensure that every House member is having a constituent assembly. It will be a right, it will be a responsibility and a duty that at every every month, every House member must have one last one day for the entire constituent member so that I as a member can also come and view the interests of my people at intervals and I can also take their, their interests to work and attend to them in whatever capacity that is available for me to attend to it. And I, I strongly believe if the opportunity is given to me, this interest I will hold dearly to my heart to ensure that I will never fail the people of Etiosa on 21. And I strongly pray that God Almighty will lead me to that throne of grace. Thank you very much. zero, the hero we elevate. This is our story. Glory to glory, across the grace. Hi, Barista Lado Tuazan, your preferred choice for the Lagos State House of Assembly, Etiosa on 21. 
under the auspices of All Progressive Congress, a party of choice. I want to offer myself for this position. If given the opportunity, I will be readily available to serve your interest. I believe strongly that if given the opportunity to serve, which you and I can jointly develop each other to a greater head, I want you to be, to be part of the success story of developing each other to an enviable height, to making each other the world's best city, making each other the heaven of opportunities, ensuring that the, the, the common good of each other is reaped for the benefit of the people of each other. And with me, Olado Twanzan, I'll be readily available to give you those opportunities, to offer you the best advantage closeness to your value interest, and to ensure that the dividend of democracy is put on the table of, of, of the good people of each other. Thank you very much. Je vous amo, à Chorom amo. Together we go make a moya, make we follow 